see the our real estate industry per se is uh, really dominating every city earlier it used to be bombay and delhi but now it's spreading all over and this is mainly due to <clears throat> land prices which is uh, something which is beyond control of architects it has got lot to do with basic policies also so you look at now we are in bombay where average price is now in a in a good area is about 70000 80000 90000 per square feet but at the same time say a city like baroda where the best of locations you will get it for 6 7 8000 8, per square feet so my cost of construction whether it is in bombay or gurugram or baroda it is the same it is the land prices and that is uh, really you know uh, uh, attracting some of these real estate developers maybe local governments and is very unfortunate especially in in a city like bombay where now government is a partner so even if you own a piece of land my construction cost i can afford say whatever 3000 4000 per square feet but to get the plans approved you know to get the to use of uh, full potential of fsa etc it goes almost up to 6 7 10 000 per square feet which is something which uh, we have to be really uh, worried about and that's why you don't see much of uh, you know as you ask for that kind of character building in in architecture it is more or less what sells you know in, in a, well we are uh, correct no but actually we are, we are responsible we cannot uh, shy away from that but then uh, these are the hardcore realities you know today again if you ask any real estate developer he would give many times more weightage to real estate agent you know one who actually sells uh, or promotes the scheme then the architects which actually the same real estate agent also works on our plans <laughs> you know he sells our plans well as an architect i am uh, i must say that uh, we are much better off now in terms of technology in terms of uh, you know what uh, transferring our drawings into reality so whether uh, we work in baroda we work in bilwara or we work in bombay you know we have good sets of uh, contractors good choice of materials so all that is really beneficial even uh, now minimum workmanship is assured earlier when we used to go to the site we used to see you know whether it is on katkuna hai ke nahi now all those things are things of the past well i would say that sense of belonging doesn't exist people wants to do really things very fast and this we see in papers every day you can look at our infrastructure you know so some of the best infrastructures is also failing so that is something to do with essentially workmanship there is not, i don't think people are saving money or having some shortcuts in doing that it is more of negligence and that's the actually attitude building you know so that sense of belonging is diminishing that i think uh, at on, on a much larger scale at society level we have to inculcate that kind of uh, attitude okay.